The Dutch Umbrella Company provides public use umbrellas to be shared all across Philadelphia through the use of city galleries and businesses as drop off points. Where some may see a perfectly white umbrella, many of our city's artists see a perfectly blank canvas instead. Ha Ha Magazine, an online quarterly on the art world beat, collaborated with Dutch Umbrella to give some of Philly's most unique artists a chance to redesign and then recirculate a few umbrellas throughout the city. After a short run, the umbrellas will be auctioned off with proceeds benefiting a Philadelphia art charity. As your host, I'll be giving you a brief look at each artist and how they've decided to leave their mark on each umbrella in a series we call the Dutch Umbrella Episodes. Ha Ha Magazine, high on art, heavy on antics. Hey everybody, I'm Lily Delphia for Ha Ha Magazine on the first of our Dutch Umbrella episodes. We're using Philadelphia's premier umbrella sharing program to give you an inside look at the city's best artists. Right now, we're in beautiful South Philadelphia visiting Yis Goodwin of Nosego. You might have recognized his beautiful murals all over Philadelphia or maybe even the brightly colored toys that he's been selling everywhere. But right now, we're gonna go inside and check out what he's been doing with the umbrellas that we gave him. Let's take a peek. Yis Goodwin is a Philly born and bred 24 year old artist. His style is best described as happy and energetic and he makes sure to stay light on concept and heavy on fun. He loves using his art to bring joy to others and is currently working with the mural arts program as a lead artist on the 4th and Porter Streets mural. Hey Yis! Hey, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Good. I'm check out your umbrella. Oh, thank you, thank you. Tell me a little about what you're doing. Right now, I'm just working on the umbrella. It's for the most part just a stream of consciousness, just started painting it mm -hmm. and seeing what comes out. Okay. As I'm painting. Awesome. How did? How exactly did you do it? Like, what was the process? What did you use? Uh, I used aerosol and uh, paint markers, just because I knew the aerosol will uh, go well with the with the fabric more right. than like acrylic, which would probably crack after it closes. So. It looks great. Thank you. Thank you. It's still. Still being worked on. Hopefully, the finished product will be good. I heard you were um, working with the mural arts program too. Yeah, I just finished my first commission mural for mural arts, and um, and that's out on Fourth and Porter. Did you draw on any of your past experiences to kind of just figure out where to go with the umbrella? Um, well, I kind of have like just like I guess like a regular just uh, I guess like style that I like a go-to style that I do okay. and um, just let it just let it flow just let it come natural and usually those end up being my best works um, when I try too hard you know it doesn't come out the way I would want it to okay. I just let it flow where do you think you're gonna go next because um, this is great so far I'm just gonna let I'm just gonna like not think about it and okay. let it happen for the most part that sounds good yeah cool well, thanks for spending time with us. Oh, thank you. No problem. I'm excited to see what comes up next. Oh, thank you. <laughs> All right, well, we'll see you later. Yes, definitely. Cool. Take care. Have a good one. Sure.